guys, it's Issa and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my lovely top knot. Yes guys, I love this bun. It can't even fit in the frame. Let's move it back y'all, move it back. <laughs> my lovely top knot. I love this bun like it's everything to me. It's the best protective style that you could literally do. Your hair is tucked inside this bun for the whole week. What? Yes, because you can't preserve the style. You put a scarf on and you go to bed. And all you got to do is touch up your edges and you don't even have to do that, okay? I am wearing two different outfits in this video. So it did take me two days to film this video. That's why you see me wearing this and then a whole other outfit. But if you want to see how you do this top knot, then make sure you go ahead and keep watching. This is a two-week two week this is like a two day old flat twist out and <clears throat> don't mind my face i just woke up but it's on my skin so clear got a tutorial y'all not a tutorial on my skin but a routine the most basic routine ever but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and start by detangling my hair real quick I'm just going to fast forward this because you guys know how to detangle hair by now. If not, then I'll leave some links in the description box. Alright y'all, so now y'all want to make sure y'all have this big puff of a fro. Pretty simple, right? Just brushing out the curls that your hair had. Hold on, let me get my mirror. So I'm going to be using the Gorilla Snot. Y'all know that I love the Gorilla Snot. And I'm just going to be putting this in my hair and making sure that my hair is sleek. And I'm going to go ahead and fix my baby hairs while I'm at it. Take about this much. I'll probably need more, but I'm just going to take about that much for now. And I'll go ahead right now and I just put like a bunch on my edges this like that and then we're gonna go get some more gel and put it towards the back what I like about this gel is that it doesn't flake a lot unless your hair is already dirty then don't flake like my hair flaked last week because it was dirty when I tried this but it's not going to flake today, obviously, because my hair is clean. So you just want to make sure that you're pushing your hair into one motion. You see, and you can use both hands. I kind of want to aim to get my bun a little higher. So I'm going to brush higher and try to get my hair higher. Because last week when I did it, it was kind of low. But I want it to be high this time. See that? So people have trouble doing their buns and getting them tight but really you just have to use the motion of both hands and you're gonna be straight there we go I want my bun to be like yay high <laughs> I don't know why I want my bun so high and when I put my hair tie on I try to make a little bun with my own hair because we don't want much of our hair sticking out. And now that I got everything pretty much settled, I'm going to work on my baby hairs. Let's work on these baby hairs, baby. So I'm wearing different clothes because it's literally the next day so if my hair looks a little bit different it's because obviously it's the next day I have to touch my hair up anyway so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I do from here. You're going to put this loop over the bun and then you're going to have two sections. So if you guys don't know there is a ponytail right here see so there's a little not a ponytail ponytail holder basically. 
what do you call these a scrunchie there we go there's a scrunchie right here and so what you're going to do is you're going to twist you're going to twist and I like to twist tight now for me I cannot multitask and do them at the same time so what I do is I twist one first you know and then I kind of hold it and I twist the other side and I twist that as tight as I can as well and so then you want to go ahead and <clears throat> wrap them around each other to create a loop I don't know if you guys can see that loop but it's there and you're just gonna continue twisting the whole point of this is to twist twist and tuck we're gonna call this twist and tuck so after that, you're going to go ahead and do the loop again. Well, pretty much, yeah. Loop. And you want to go over. First of all, this this is fine right here. This is fine right here. You gotta, you kind of have to create the look that is comfortable for you. And so right here, I'm taking a bobby pin, and I am going to just stick it in. I don't know if y'all can see, but I'm doing my best to show y'all. Put a bobby pin on this side too. Loop, loop, loop. And this time my loop is going to go on top of my ponytail because, um, I want to cover the middle section okay so I loop on top you see this hair sticking out you want to make sure when you create your loops that it covers the middle section of your hair and there we go might need to two bobby pins to hold it down if you don't have like the big ones I recommend using the big ones but I'm all out bobby pins keep falling out my mouth okay finally okay <laughs> and then after you're done with that you're pretty much your loops you know content you I'm trying to figure out where I left off my loop it's gonna come around this way okay and y'all can see I'm using some crusty hair but it really does not matter to me and I'm going over this section again over here just the only reason I'm going over this section again is so my bun can look proportionate okay that's the only reason and the, the buns, like when you do them, for me anyway, they always come out in different shapes and sizes every time you do them. Sometimes it, come, it comes out better than others, and other times it's just like a fail. <laughs> but you will get it. It's there. Okay? And this is my bun. Simple and easy. Okay, and I'm going to remove my hair. Tie. my edges do not look the same because I did them today and um, I was too lazy to make them look that extreme but you know I wasn't trying to argue with my hair today like it is what it is this is what it looks like and that's what we gonna do so thank you guys so much for watching this video I really appreciate it make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and like comment and share if you will if you like what you see subscribe y'all and i will see you guys in the next video bye y'all wait get some money fuck the rollie fuck the rollie patty face my career taking off these hoes jogging in pace where these hoes on their mouth